is Chris Walker from Chris Walker's Nutrition Therapy.com and today I just want to talk to you about five things, five things that can have you losing uh, five pounds in about 10 days, okay? So uh, I just want to talk to you about these five things and if you include these five things in your diet, uh, in your daily practice for the next 10 days, you should lose about five pounds, okay? So uh, no lie, no lie, no lie, you can really do this. Okay, so number one, number one, the number one thing you need to cut out of your diet is this diet soda, okay? Diet soda is not good for you at all. It's very addictive, it causes weight gain, it causes things like cancer, uh, messes up your hormones. Instead, use the best beverage in the world, water, okay? Just drink some good water and that will be great for you. Number two, the number two thing that we need to do is uh, cut the bread out, eliminate the bread from your diet, okay? It causes weight gain, it gives you high insulin spikes in your body, and when your insulin is up, you cannot lose fat because you don't have any other hormones that are being produced that will allow you to let go of your body fat, okay? When insulin is up, your fat is trapped, okay? It also contains gluten, and gluten is, um, something that really messes up your digestive system. It's a platform for a lot of other autoimmune diseases and it's something that you don't wanna have if you wanna be healthy and lose the weight, okay? So we need to cut that out. Um, instead, use lettuce to wrap whatever you wanna wrap, okay? Um, you can make sandwiches with that. There's a lot of recipes that you can use with lettuce wraps instead of the bread, okay? So use lettuce wraps instead of the bread. Number three, interval training. Interval training is really, really great. It's better, a lot better than slow state, steady cardio. You want to do some interval training uh, to really boost your weight loss and boost your fat loss, okay? There's a lot of research studies that have been done on that and uh, you lose weight a lot faster by doing interval training than just doing steady state, slow cardio, probably on the elliptical or on the treadmill, okay? So how you want to do that is you want to do something really fast. Do a really quick burst for maybe about 30 seconds and then rest for about a minute or do some slow or, or more moderate cardio for about a minute and then keep on repeating that cycle, okay? That's how you do the interval training. Number four, number four, okay, we need to cut that sugar out. Cut it pretty much out almost completely, maybe 99%. Um, it, it's really bad for you. It causes inflammation. It's very, very processed. It's, it's very toxic to the body. Um, and it causes weight gain. It just is there's a lot of problems when you happen when you um, have sugar in your diet. So we need to cut that out completely. Instead, use something like stevia. You can get that at most health food stores. Just go to the health food store, ask for stevia. There's a lot of different products that contain stevia that you can use, and it's really, really uh, better to have stevia instead of the sugar. Okay, so cut that out. Number five, I know you're not gonna like me for this, um, but there's there's no way we really around this one. If you can cut out the alcohol, okay? Just cut it out. Uh, you know, it's very toxic again. It's bad for your liver. It causes inflammation. It causes weight gain. Um, it, there's no way to really have the alcohol in the diet if you're trying to lose weight. After you've gone to your goal or reached your destiny, then perhaps you can include some uh, occasional drinks, maybe some red wine in your diet. But on the journey to that path of losing weight, we need to cut the alcohol out completely, okay? Instead, go to the health food store and ask for something called kombucha tea, okay? It gives you the similar feeling of having a drink of wine, okay? It's got the same consistency, um, but is much better for you and much healthier for you, okay? So it's called kombucha tea, okay? So those are the five things that you need to do, my friend, to lose weight in the next 10 days. So five pounds in the next 10 days, just follow these tips. Um, I hope you've enjoyed these quick tips that I um, had for you today. Um, I'll be back again with some more tips and some more ways to lose weight and have your body the healthiest as it can be. Again, it's Chris Walker, your nutritional therapist and wellness coach, and have yourself an amazing day.